Hey class, this is Coach Mick. I'm going to show you the proper way to get into a three-point stance starting with sumo. Uh, I have my daughter Riley out here. Let me get her on the screen. Yeah. Hey Riley. Hey. Are you going to show us some stuff today? Yes. Okay, cool. So what we're going to start with is Riley's feet are shoulder width apart. The feet are directly in front of her. And uh, what we're going to do is Riley is going to demonstrate a sumo stance. So, Riley, you ready? Okay. So, sumo, down. Right away, Riley has lowered her center of gravity. Her knees are at 90 degrees, and uh, she's got a really good base underneath her. She's ready to attack. Now that Riley is in a sumo stance, what we're going to do is we're going to go to a three-point stance. Uh, so, Riley, hand out, three-point, down. See how she fell forward? She's got weight distributed on her toes. She's ready to attack. Her hand, other hand is still on her knee. Head up. She's ready to fire off. The uh, sports science, uh, we have a offensive lineman hitting a, a defender. Uh, this hit causes the defender to fly up with a hit and lift. Uh, one thing to keep in note here is right here, you see the two 90 degrees uh, two 90 degree angles that are generated uh, with both the forearms and the legs. Uh, these two 90 degrees creates a straight line from the ground to the delivering blow to the defender's chest. Uh, it goes straight through. There's no force loss. Um, there's no uh, slippage. There's no degradation. Nothing like that. Uh, and what that does is when out on impact, it hits him with about 600 pounds of force. Uh, and in the air, he goes approximately nine feet, and when he turns to the ground, he hits with about 1,600 pounds of force. Um, this is why you want to do uh, the sumo and three-point stance technique correctly.